I'm Boomer Esiason for SI.com with my top five quarterbacks heading into week 13 of the NFL season. Number five, Phillip Rivers. What a game he had against Kansas City last week, throwing the game-winning touchdown pass under a minute left and upsetting the Kansas City Chiefs. By the way, he's completing 70% of his passes throughout the season. He's certainly the renaissance man and has taken to Mike McCoy's offense. Number four, Carson Palmer. His team is on a four-game winning streak this week on the road at Philadelphia. Last week, they demolished Indianapolis. The best thing about Carson Palmer over the last couple weeks, he hasn't thrown an interception, and he looks like he's finally figuring out Bruce Arians' offense. Number three, Big Ben Roethlisberger, by far playing his best football thus far this season. Last week against Cleveland, led his team yet again. No interceptions. As a matter of fact, the week before, he threw four touchdown passes and no interceptions against the Detroit Lions. They now, after an 0-4 start, find themselves embroiled right in the mix for the wild card in the AFC. A huge game against the Baltimore Ravens Thursday night. Number two, finally, Tom Brady makes it into the top five. What a thrilling comeback, 24 points down to Denver Broncos and Peyton Manning. He orchestrates his biggest comeback of his career. He's now completing over 70% of his passes over the last three weeks. Three touchdowns, no interceptions, and they're on the road to a nine straight loss Houston Texan team led by Case Keenum. And number one, going into week 13, Drew Brees. His team is nine and two. They go on the road to Seattle. They have won three games in a row. He's completing over 70% of his passes as well. He is going to have the toughest assignment of all the quarterbacks this week going into maybe the most difficult place to play in all of the NFL. The Seattle Seahawks are looking for the number one seed in the NFC. Let's see if they can stop Drew Brees on the road, and it looks to be like it's going to be in inclement weather. I'm Boomer Esiason, and that's my top five quarterbacks heading into week 13 of the NFL season.